All right, this is the whitetail hunter coming at you from the Rock and Bee again, and uh, I think it's September 8th. I might have said 6th earlier, but uh, I just got done putting down, down some uh, urea fertilizer. This field here is Alpha Rack Plus, but I it uh, got a lot of weeds in it, but there's tons of clover and alfalfa and chicory in it, but there's so many deer in it. I didn't want to cut it or spray it because they might jump out of there and get on the brassicas. But uh, this side over here, just up to this tree here, this was all uh, beets and greens from Whitetail Institute. And it goes all the way around this field. Down the other side. And this was spots where it came in. Now we had a light rain, but then we had a really heavy rain. And uh, <clears throat> it didn't do us any good. I don't think it had a chance to set the seed, and I think it washed a lot of seed. But then through this crack here to the other side of the field where I put the big and beastie, the big and beastie from Frigid Forest. <clears throat> it's kind of what I expected to happen. Big and Beastie's a pretty pro proven Brasica food plot. And uh, they're kind of stunted in here a little bit. Now, you know, I only planted these, oh, heck, I'd have to look back, but I think August 15th. Mm -hmm. So, <clears throat> it hasn't been too up along, but, you know, I want to get up a little bit, and I had some urea left over, and some 13, 13, 13, and I just threw what I had left on here, and the problem was with that heavy rain was it kind of patched up my seeds a little bit over here, but, I mean, they're, they're too thick in spots, it washed them off the top of the knobs and put them down in other places, but these are big Good sized plants, look at this. And throwing that fertilizer on there now, they're just gonna blow up. And uh, get going. I don't know, it seems like you can't catch a break this year. You can't get a decent light rain. We have one light rain. And I thought maybe them seeds will set. Mm -hmm. A couple days went by, and uh, then we got blasted with a torrential downpour. So that's going to be a good winter food plot here. And of course, it goes clear over on the other side over there. There's a couple acres mm -hmm. in here. <clears throat> anyway, so that goes the battle between the Big and Beastie and the White Tail Institute Beets and Greens for right now. Looks like the Big and Beasties. Big and beastie. Proofs in the pudding. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Anyway, white tail hunter, we're going to back on out of here today. You guys have a good evening. <laughs>